Okay, so it's the next day. We're on the road. We're going to Glacier National Park. We didn't stop to eat breakfast or anything, and last night we unpacked the car and packed it all back up so that everything fit nice and neat in it. And um, we didn't have breakfast or anything yet, so... the line let's see if we can find a um, marker of some kind yeah marker of some kind oh, there it is Even right there <laughs> Montana shout out to Petrina so we pulled into this gas station to get gas and it is also a casino okay I thought that was pretty interesting it also has a Subway and Stone House Coffee, Deli, and Tobacco Outlet. I just thought it was a, um, interesting that they had a casino. It's called Lucky Lil's Casino. Okay, so we're in Butte now. Butte, Montana. We still have five more hours. Until we get to the campsite. Yep. We're about two and a half more hours away from the campsite. If you can see those mountains in the background, that's what I was wanting you to see. I didn't get the phone up before uh, they disappeared. But the trees and stuff are really nice too. All right, we're in the Tobacco Valley and there is a river or a lake or something on that side. And I think it said we're in the Kootenai. Kootenai? I think it's Kootenai. That's how I would pronounce it, but I have no idea. National Forest. National Forest. Go. We can see that lake or whatever now. Yeah, it's a lake. Look at the beautiful mountains. And we only have about 20 more minutes left to go. Yeah. It's 100 degrees. So this is our campground, our camping spot, picnic table and stuff. They misspelled his name. That's okay though. It's been an uphill battle for him his whole life, so it's okay. So we registered at our campsite and now we are going off back into town to get something to eat. Yep. These mountains are just beautiful. Yep. This is where we just ate. It had pretty decent food, but um, their air conditioner was broken and it's like 107 degrees out. Yeah, that's not their fault. It's though. not their fault. And plus they were also understaffed, but I think they did a pretty good job. Yeah, all um, things considered. All things considered, yeah. The food was really great. We had ice water, of course, but the ice water was still great. So, yeah. Overall, I think it was a great experience. Now we're going to G's Homemade Ice Cream. It must be good, there's a line. So, we got the G's Homemade Ice Cream. I got the peach flavor. Evan, of course, got his vanilla. Today is also Evan's birthday. Yay! But it's actually really good. 